Hi everyone, this is the abs and back stretch video. So for this video you will need a mat. We're going to start with something simple. Actually we'll start with a standing exercise that you can do to stretch out your back. So we're going to do a forward bend. You'll start by reaching up as high as you can, taking a deep breath in, and then reaching for your ankles. And then you're just going to bend your body towards your knees. If your legs are bent, that's fine. If you can't touch your toes, that's fine too. Just do the best you can. Keep breathing. Try to breathe it, bring it in closer. Bring your uh, chest closer to your thighs. And breathe normal with it. And now we're going to roll up slowly by vertebra and come back up. Okay, from here we're going to get onto the mat. This is another great stretch for your back. This is the cat. It's also good for those of you who have scoliosis or any back issues. This will bring flexibility to the spine. So what you're going to do is First you'll take the table position. From here you're going to breathe in and arch your back at the same time. And then you're going to breathe out and go into a scared cat position. And then breathe in, arch your back. And then breathe out. Breathe in. And then breathe out. And breathe out one last time. Excellent. From here, we're going to do the child's pose. So we're going to come back, bring your head down, and just bring your hands down to your side. Bring calmness and relaxation and a nice stretch to your back. Good. From here, we're going to do a twist. So we're going to take your left leg, you're going to put it behind your right thigh, you're going to have your right knee bent, and then you're going to grab onto your left knee put and uh, bring your right hand in behind your spine, and then turn your head to the right. You're going to breathe in and feel your spine stretch upwards. And then breathe out, releasing all tension. Breathe in again. Breathe out. And breathe in again one more time. Excellent. Now we're going to switch sides. So now you're bringing your right leg by your left thigh. You're going to bring bend your left leg. And now you're going to grab your right knee with your right arm and bring your left arm behind your spine. You're going to, once again, take a deep breath in, lengthen your spine, and then breathe out any tension. Once again, breathe in, lengthen your spine, and breathe out again. And one more time. Excellent. Now from here we're going to do the roller. So you're basically just going to grab onto your knees like so. We're going to roll back and then roll forward. And this is really, feels nice on the back. It also helps to align the spine. And you definitely want to do this on a mat. You can do it on the grass, but make sure you have a mat, just in case. Excellent. From here, you're going to lie down. You're going to bring your arms out to the side. You're going to bring your knees up. And then you're just going to bring them to the side and turn your head to the opposite side 
at the same time. You should feel a nice stretch in through here. Excellent. Now bring your legs back to the middle again. And now we're going to do the other side. And remember to switch your head to the other side as well. And breathe normal. And bring your legs back, back down. From here, you're gonna have, you bring your right leg in towards your left thigh. From here, you're gonna raise your arms up. You're gonna take your opposite hand and grab your opposite foot, like so. Giving a nice stretch to your external oblique muscles and internal oblique muscles and your serratus anterior muscle as well. Excellent. Now we'll switch sides. Okay, once again, arms up. And you're just gonna grab the opposite hand to the opposite foot. Now we're going to do the hip flexors. So you're going to stand with one leg out in front of you. You're going to place both hands on the one on the right knee. You're going to take a deep breath in and you're going to come forward and breathe out. Come back, breathe in and breathe out. Bring your foot out a little bit more. Now we're gonna put the left arm up, raise the left arm up like so. You're gonna breathe in, and then you're gonna breathe out and bring the left arm down, and then bring it back up again. I'm gonna do this two more times. Breathe in and come down. And one more time, breathe in, and come back down. Getting a nice good stretch in your hip flexor. We're gonna switch legs. Okay, once again, starting with both hands on the left knee now. Gonna take a deep breath in. And come down. Breathe in and come down. Now we're going to breathe in and raise the right arm up and come down. Raise the right arm up again. Breathe in, come back down. And one more time. And come back down. Excellent. So these are some stretches that you can do on days that you work your abs and your back out or if you just work your back out there's certain stretches that we just did in this video that will really help uh, bring flexibility to the spine, stretch out the back and same with some of the stretches that we did to stretch out the ab muscles or the oblique muscles. Anyways I hope you enjoyed your cool down video and I hope you have a really good day. Thank you. <laughs>